So I don't trust the Germans, man. Irrigated kickball action just keeps coming at you. Don't forget your sham wows again this week because mm. we started off <laughs> from Springer, 5 o'clockers, oh, 6 30, field one. Woo! You two tell me, make your case right now. Although, <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, I'll go ahead and write a big number next to 5 o'clockers, but, but, but make your case, please. Like, I, what do I say? <laughs> We got a win, so uh, we got some momentum going our way. Uh, it's more momentum than we have right now. Yeah, I guess that's true. Uh, you know, ooh, ooh. you're making excellent points there, Bar. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, oh, no, no. stat tracker. Yeah. No, I mean we we know the five o'clockers, and you know my personal thing to podcast pass of the five o'clockers is a team that I've always wanted to beat so much, and I just can't, just can't get that monkey off the back. Uh, but you know, again, we come out there, we know the team that we're up against, we know how good you guys are, especially after that nice showcasing you've had against the situation with that 0-0 tie, so we know it's going to be very, very tough to get any runs on you, and it's going to be equally as tough to hold you to zero runs like the situation did. Uh, but, you know, we got some speed on the team, and we just need to play our game and get some kicks and get some ducks on the pond that George likes to say, and hope for the best. All right. Yeah, I, th I mean, what does it say? You want me to make the case? Uh, you know, like, yeah, I think we're better at kickball. But, um, <laughs> yeah, but I will say this. I, I don't think we're taking uh, Rumsfeld. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we're going to From an analytical <laughs> perspective, taking yourself out of Rumsfeld and a just being an analyst. I would agree with that statement. <laughs> but I think that you guys, uh, I look at Rumspringer, so we're not taking you guys lightly. I look at Rumspringer and I see a team that uh, is a sleeping giant uh, and that I don't, you guys have all the tools to be a very good kickball You got team. tools, all right. So, <laughs> <laughs> thank but, you. Uh, I, I would, no, I mean, I mean it legit, like, you guys had the pieces to be a good kickball team. And I just think that there's something mental going on where, I don't know if you guys believe it necessarily to the core because it seems like when things start going wrong, it just it falls apart for you guys. Uh, but really, you guys should be going in there with the confidence and the swagger of a team that's a veteran a veteran squad full of athletes that know how to play the game. You know, Abe Lincoln swagger. So, yeah, I want I want you guys. To, uh, you know, obviously, we're you know I want you guys to play well against us. Uh, in, 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 you know, bring the game. Mm -hmm. I, I think you guys can and, and you should, so. I'm, I'm heading off to Steel Town after this game. I don't have to work on Thursday, so best believe I'm leaving it all on the table. Uh, and I know Ricky's going to fire us up with one of those emails. I, I can just sense it. We didn't get an email last week, so. Oh, so that's why you came out flat. <laughs> that's why you want me to get that hyped up email. Mm -hmm. So I expect one at least two pages long. Now, regardless of what happens in this game, man, I, I, I said it last week like five times in a row, but I'm a fan of Rum Springer, so I want you guys to do well. Uh, just to say, just have that confidence, man. Just focus, and yeah, you guys got the pieces to score runs and, and be deadly. So, mm. I hope you don't figure it out against me, I guess. But. We'll see. <laughs> we shall see. I spent most of that time drawing a, a Sasquatch with mechanical wheels as legs, chasing Matt <laughs> Wellbrock. I like, how skinny, I, I like how skinny you drew me. Thank you very much. Well, you're a compliment. stick figure. I, I blew out all my talent <laughs> on the Sasquatch, on the, on the five o'clock or Sasquatch, but as they walk a like trucker hat on. That's kind of how I see this game going. Wait. I see stick figure Matt Wellbrock rounding the bases with. Speed. Speed lines everywhere. Wheelchair Sasquatch is my uh, representation of, of Brent in a 
John. No, no, it's a John Lanine. He's he's wheelchair Sasquatch. Coming back. Quick, but not quick enough. Um, I so know, I, I, we did not do any drugs before this one, I swear. <laughs> Speak for yourself! Ha <laughs> <laughs> um, so ha! So what do you got here? Like, five one, five o'clockers. It's a clock I like five. five, yes. Yeah. Five o'clockers. I like five, that he gave us four a and a half. Run. I think you'll score a run. Troy will kick Guy in. <laughs> Done. Sounds about right. You, you either got Guy kicks second and Troy kicks fifth. Well, yeah, I guess that does make sense. That makes, yeah, I was gonna that say, makes yeah, perfect yeah, sense. Yeah. A lot yeah. of times the fifth kicker does kick them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, so the next game we have in the 6.30 hours, uh, peanut butter jelly time, taking on the new kickheads. Uh, let's uh, talk about this game a little bit. What do you guys uh, see, foresee in this uh, squad? I, I, see, I see a lot of promise from a peanut butter jelly squad. Um, you know, having a chance to play with them last week and, and knowing them from seasons uh, before, that, uh, you know, it just, it just needs a little bit of click there uh, to get things started. So they got the engine all set up. They just need to put that oil in there and crank it and just get that stuff all, you know, kind of, uh, what's the thing, lubricated around mm. success. Yeah. Uh, and this is a game to do it. It's against the new Kickheads, uh, a team that is always coming out looking for a fight. Uh, and, uh, you know, I have a couple friends on this team as well, and it's just, uh, I think they're just not there yet as a squad to hold up with a team like PBJ. Uh, I give them a couple more weeks to get all the kinks figured out. But I say I got PB and J by uh, three, four runs in this one. Probably about, yeah, I'll, I'll stick with three. All right. Yeah. As someone who's uh, actually, this is a fact about Brent Wentworth, uh, I'm actually colorblind. Uh, two colors that really messed me up are navy blue and purple. It's hard for me to tell the difference between the two of them. And uh, when I look at peanut butter jelly time and new kick heads in the block, I can definitely tell the difference between these two teams. And I agree with you and your spot on analysis. I think peanut butter and jelly is uh, a class above the new kickheads, and I think they'll win by four and a half runs. I moved into a new place oh, this week. I'm actually really proud of myself. That, that was time. good. <laughs> my my insight's going to be far better. And I haven't had a really chance to go much grocery shopping, so I've had to eat peanut butter and jelly sandwich every day at lunch all this week. Mm. That's three peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Um, I'm gonna probably have half a one tomorrow. Three and a half runs. Peanut butter and jelly time. Mm. I put Cool Ranch Doritos on my peanut butter and jelly sandwich. That's what? Yeah, dude. It's freaking awesome. Did you all picture of Sasquatch <laughs> putting Cool Ranch Doritos on peanut butter and jelly sandwiches? Yeah, you think I'm high. But <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I say three and a half runs to be... No! I say more! Damn it. The be, Doritos... Be more! Yes. <laughs> the Doritos represent... <laughs> five runs! Two of you people know what we're talking about. Alright. Five runs. We'll go with five runs. No, yeah. Yeah. I, I, said, I, I said you three and a half, said four us, and a half, and you said five, and we go with five. I like that. that you swayed us with your brilliant, well-reasoned logic. So. Battlestar Balsactica against Chicken Tetrazzini. Will the Angry Birds give up the first run of the season? Yes, they will. Mm. Battlestar. They've been scoring at what? Four and then five? Five and then four? Four and then five. Oh, they had five. So, yeah. They'll score five. No, nope, they'll score six this week in a 6-1 win over the Angry Birds. Four and a half to Battlestar. Ooh, that's a good uh, line right there. I think uh, Battlestar is a good, a talented offensive team. They just got weapons. Michael Macy, Philip Tanner, uh, Jeff Moorhart. I think, yeah, they're going to be too tough for Chicken Touch Regime to contain, especially when they start hitting those bombs out there. I'll go... Um, yeah, I'll go Battlestar by four and a half, and I'll predict uh, that Jeff Moorhart will have a home run in this game. I will bet you three beers he does not. That's a I steep, don't know why. That's <laughs> a steep bet. Yeah, that is very steep. Are we talking about pounders? I'm, uh, I'm interested in this. We have a double or nothing bet that we need. No, we're getting to that. Okay. Chicken Tetrazzini, back right. up. Um, Thank you. 
you know, one thing that we were talking about Battlestar a long time ago was when they were first assembled was their outfield. And, you know, if a way to attack a team was the outfield. Uh, I feel like Chicken Tetrazzini arrived at this party one season too late. Uh, their bombs are not going to affect a Battlestar team of now versus a Battlestar team of the past. I am going to go with you guys on the five to six runs uh, for Battlestar, and I'm going to flip this script on Chicken Tetrazzini. Has not allowed a run scored so far. Will not score a run this game at all. Mm. All right. So there you have it. Battlestar by five. Four? Uh, two. Four. Three and a half. Three and a half? Three. We'll go three and a half. <laughs> Seven. We, 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 we just don't know how to handle it. <laughs> <laughs> my, right. my, my, my haggling style is to just sit here and point it to see what it Five, four, three. You get really good deals on cars. <laughs> you wouldn't believe what I paid. You just that. stare at it until they come down in their price. I'll be back at 7.30 hour. This is the sticker price. <laughs> so, I... We'll be back. I write yeah. nothing on a sheet of paper, and I hold it for a while, and then I just slide it over there, <laughs> and then I don't make eye contact again.